Hi there, it's uh, Zan. Um, you may wonder why I'm in um, these kind of cheap and tacky surroundings. Um, my hotel room is not so fancy. This is uh, the days in in Spokane, the glamorous life of a comics publisher, uh, at least a comics indie publisher. Um, I'm here uh, getting ready for PatCon, which starts tomorrow. I actually thought that the setup was today, and so I booked it to get here, and then I couldn't get in. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, I'm here getting ready for the show, and it is Thursday, which is, of course, Throwback Thursday. And so I wanted to share a little something with you, um, and I'll just put this up here. So I don't know if, <laughs> if you can recognize that kid there. Um, that is Richie, a.k.a. me. Um, back in eighth grade, and uh, uh, Richie liked comic books. Uh, he um, spent about, I think about sixty dollars a, a a month on them, maybe even more than that. Um, obsessed with the comic books. Oh, Richie. Um, anyway, um, also uh, Richie was uh, a young gay boy who was not quite ready to talk about that and come out about that. Uh, and uh, the very next year, um, actually, well, two years after that, um, I would uh, come out to friends and uh, it turned out to be a, a good experience and I had the support that I needed and uh, things were good. Things were very good. I was, I was a lucky kid. Um, so a lot of kids are not as lucky. Uh, and a few years ago, I did a comic uh, with artist Mark Brill called The Power Within, uh, which we did in response to a uh, series of news reports about young people uh, not having a good experience, uh, either being LGBT or being perceived as such and getting harassment and bullying. Um, and so we, we did, we wrote a story about, or I wrote a story for Mark to illustrate about uh, a kid who has a low point and deals with it um, and you know, comes through it okay. And I think that's an important story to tell. Um, and I think it's a, an important thing to have a conversation about harassment and about having people treat you badly. Um, and I also have a conversation about how we treat people. Um, it's not us and them. It's not the aggressors and the bullied. It's not the victims and the, you know, oppressors. Um, it's us, it's all of us. Uh, I think we just have to talk about um, how to get along with each other. And so uh, Northwest Press is doing a comic series uh, headed up by some amazing uh, editors and a lot of really talented and uh, generous people. Uh, the series is called Rise, Comics Against Bullying. And uh, you can check it out at uh, tinyurl.com slash risecomics. And I'll put a little link for you. Um, but uh, I think it's important. Um, you know, I, I, I don't think we should, you know, outlaw feeling bad. <laughs> uh, I don't think that's possible. And I don't think it's, um, I don't think it's what people want. I think people just want um, kindness. And people want uh, children to feel safe and comfortable and grow up to be wonderful adult people. And, uh, we need to do everything we can to help that happen. So uh, please check out the uh, series. Uh, we're doing Kickstarter right now. We just got a, a staff pick as one of the good comics projects that they think you ought to check out over at Kickstarter. Uh, so please check it out and uh, pitch in a dollar or two. Uh, just spread the word. And uh, hopefully we can get these, these comics out to kids. Uh, and the conversations can keep happening about... Uh, not being bullies. <laughs> uh, thanks a lot. And uh, to all the little Richies out there in the world who are dealing with stuff, uh, hang in there. Um, be strong. Make good choices. And we'll see you soon. And come to PatCon. Bye.